Hey guys, it's Ryan from Failure Anthem. Gonna do a little rig uh, rundown for lack of a better term. I guess we'll start with my bass. Just an Ernie Ball Music Man Stingray that is disgusting currently. Um, I can't tell you the last time I washed this thing. Um, yeah, I mean, it's just pretty standard. So yeah, the, the dudes at Ernie Ball uh, hooked me up with this probably two years ago. Um, and I guess a little tour of the bass. Just got a, an active humbucking pickup, a little battery casing back here. Um, it's got three band EQ and a volume. So we have bass, mid, and treble, and then volume. And I kind of put all the EQs at unity gain. Uh, I might go a little bit above, depending on how dead my strings are, which is usually pretty dead because uh, I never change them. Um, and I do have Ernie Ball strings on here currently as well. I actually use a five string set and just drop the top string. So I want to say we use uh, it's a 135, 105, 85, and 70. So we'll move on to bass cab. Uh, he's an Ampeg 610 bass cab. Um, it's absolutely wrecked and as any good bass cab should be. Um, it's just got six 10 inch speakers in it and a horn. Uh, it has a little knob on the back. Uh, you can adjust the, the frequency of the horn, but I really never touch it because I use this more than anything. It's my, uh, my B7K Ultra Dark Glass. Um, this thing's a monster. I had an Axe FX for a long time that I used for bass and heard one of these in a studio and literally just, uh, I lost my mind over it. So I ordered one and never looked back since. It's got a ton of options on it. Um, I pretty much just set and forget. Like these are my actual settings, which I don't know if that's something I'm letting all my secrets out over here for you guys. Um, but yeah, I mean, literally this drives my entire sound that we use the DI out to go straight to front of house into our ears. Um, and then I have just your basic power amp here that helps drive the cab. Uh, and that's pretty much my stage sound. Cool, so that's it. Thanks for checking out all our gear. You can head over to failureanthem.com uh, for all of our tour dates, all of our social sites.